to chill for a second and give you an update because Lord have mercy. Um, it's been an insane, insane Tuesday, but it just, it's been good, a good Tuesday. So everything just fall down today. Like I either have nothing or I have, or I have everything the same day. Um, anyways, I had Chanel's kindergarten graduation this morning. So it's fun seeing her happy. She was the soul of the party. She was always dancing and making her moves and stuff. <laughs> and then I had to like go around to work, do some cleans. I was supposed to have three cleans, but thankfully, but not thankfully because it's less money for me, but because of the day that I was having, I only had two. So I managed to finish on time. So I can come to my doctor and have my doctor's appointment and see my baby. sensation my kids were the sensation today because Chanel could not stop dancing over there and now this baby could not stop moving it was like moving and moving and moving and everyone was like oh my gosh look at the baby so oh my god I could see like now you can see it has the shape of a little human and oh my god it had long legs uh, that's not for me and the that wasn't that long either so I don't know what the heck is going on in here but Oh my gosh, I could see it moving. I heard the heartbeats and everything. It's okay. So, anyway, I'm hungry, but I don't want to eat nothing crazy because I want to go to. <sighs> People look at me. Anyway, I want to go celebrate with Chanel. I got her um, this cute little basket with a bunch of candies that it's about graduation. And I want to take the whole family today to eat so we can. Keep celebrating, you know, finish the day strong. So, um, I don't know what I should eat that it's not gonna get me super full, but I need something because I had to drive all the way to my town. I'm in another town right now. Pick up the kids, um, get Chanel dressed because she was dressed as an astronaut. So, um, and then drive all the way to wherever I'm going. So, yeah. It's been a freaking Tuesday. But everything's okay. Ugh, ugh. I also lost my jacket and I was freezing my small Puerto Rican ass over there in the doctor. <laughs> and it was right in the middle of the street. So she eats over there dirty bandage. But I love that freaking sweater. So thank the f oh, I came out from see this is what happened when you're talking. Can I get up from this side? I think I can. Fuck. Um, I go for allá. Anyway, what I was saying, my belly. <sighs> Forgot what I was saying.
the celebration continues. Are you ready to keep party? Let's go party. Yes, they have a little bus with like, how do you call that thingy? Air thingy, my youngest, for kids to jump and shit. Um, <clears throat> and it also has water, so she had to bring her bathing suit, we bring in chairs and set up for a little bit before I go to work. I only have one coming to this, so I'm not in a hurry to leave today. So anyway, I just ate some breakfast and we're ready to rock and roll. Hi, look at the sign. You can yeah. run like this. Yeah? I figure I come here for a minute and give you guys an update because my life has been insanity lately. Between me getting my life together, my health, my physical and mental health, getting into this new summer routine, now kids, um, schools are, school is over so kids are here. Like I try, I've been trying to figure it out as you saw, a schedule for the kids, a schedule like everything in my life because I'm pregnant, I've been feeling so sick that now I'm feeling better but <sighs> you know there, there's a lot and like I'm getting my life back together but I'm also trying to get myself out there get out of the comfort zone and like this week has been insane this week I've been like go 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 and I haven't had a break like to like really sit down and work or anything so I haven't been able to edit and now like the content keeps accumulating so I just like uh, but yeah, I've been trying to figure things out. I haven't been able to start with my summer routine. Um, so I'm going to start after I come from vacation. We are starting like our summer routine and yeah, my business and everything. Because over the last few days, I'm starting to kind of feel a little bit like <laughs> again, after I was feeling so good finally. And I cannot allow myself to get back there. So we're getting back in track like in my health and everything. And I've also been thinking like, where do I want to take my business? youtube wise like i definitely want to keep doing youtube and grow but like when it comes to my business stephanie wellness my membership website like i really 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 want to launch that freaking website already um but i want to do the app so um because there's gonna be so many cooking videos and everything that i want to have an app out there so that way um you can grab your phone and take it with you and do either workouts outside in the gym wherever you want or you cook your recipes in the kitchen so um i definitely need the app yeah so i've been trying like figure it out so i need to do my june um goal but basically i'm doing a 90 day sprint because i want to like launch in 90 days so there's a lot that i need to get done in 90 days but it's i'm putting too much on myself because on top of me like putting my business you know launching a new business on 90 days i'm my mindset you know i'm also working on mindset personal growth i'm in a, as i mentioned I, i'm in a 100 day challenge so i have to push myself to get those done and that's my priority right now that the mindset the mental health it's my priority so the little bit of time that i do have i had to use it for meditating working out um yarning reading because mental health is everything if my mental health is not right i'm not gonna be successful either as a mom or as a business owner or anything so i need it i prioritize but because my priority right now is my mental health and on top of that this week 
I've been full the entire week with things that just things keeps accumulating, new plans keep having. Like I'm going like, okay, I'm going to do this in the afternoon and then in the afternoon this show up and I had to go here. This day show up, I had to go there and now I've been full the whole week and I've been like stretch, stretching myself out there. Stretching, whatever, stretching. Is that how you say it? I don't know. Because I can't talk anymore. But, you know. So yeah, oh my gosh you guys, I am home. I am home, can you believe that? Anyway, I did have plans for tonight but they got canceled. There was a little situation, um, a personal one. So the plans for tonight got canceled and that means that I have today, the rest of the day like, don't you dare to freaking call me today. Like, la madre del que me llame, okay? I wanna be in my home. I haven't been in my home. So, um, I'm about to share a very unpopular opinion, okay? Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? The fucking new season of the Kardashians, the new show, actually, it's fucking fire, okay? It's like hashtag, how do you call it? Boss goals, okay? Those bitches are like, can we talk? about their fucking homes like watch the previous show season one and then watch this last episode like holy fucking shit where they come like their homes are especially okay i'm obsessed with fucking chloe's new home like are you kidding me right now i need to go to fucking google uh, chloe's new home and like print every fucking photo of her home and put it on my fucking bucket list vision like bored shit kind of like that okay because hashtag i'm not fucking kidding fucking goals anyway so i just watched the last episode of the kardashians and like there's nothing for you to get inspired and get your shit done than watching fucking bosses female fucking bosses getting their shit done you know so anyway i what i'm gonna do is i want to put in the background i cannot work without having something in the background I, I, no function, I I don't function without having something in the background. So I remember that what I used to do is I used to put TV shows that were inspiring about work, hustling, money, you know? And I stopped doing that. So what I'm doing is I'm looking for a freaking TV show. I kind of want to watch Selling Sunset. I have heard a lot of it, but I don't know if they have it on freaking Hulu. So what they have is the freaking housewives. Like, that does not call my attention and there's like a gajillion freaking different housewives like are you serious right now one two three aww <laughs> are excited about the baby mm -hmm. do you love the baby already mm -hmm. yeah you're gonna be a good sister oh my god the baby is going to throw my toys <sighs> Uh oh, oh. Uh, oh, oh, make a mess in your room. You need the other baby toys. <laughs> We're gonna get him or her baby toy. Yep. He's gonna have his own toy. Mm -hmm. And it's gonna play with yours. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I like Today I had to go and get my old car title because um, a few years ago, like three or four years ago, I had I changed uh, cars, but I did not know that the don't know what's the word in English, but the changing the name from my name to the new owner never was done. 
and now the new owner sold the car and we were like yeah we need you to you know change the name of the car whatever so i didn't have the title or anything and that was a pain in the gut we had to go to lawyers to the to the police station and a lot of stuff to get paperwork and stuff so we finally did it and then we went today and they say oh yeah it's by appointment and i was like oh, fudge you know because i can only only come fridays and this friday i'm gonna be on vacation so now i had to wait two weeks and the lady decided to you know she was like let's just talk and see if we can get you in so and um, she squeezed me in yay and i got everything done so everything about the car it's finally done and i stopped at this at this cute little restaurant i thought it was gonna be like a coffee shop but it says it's real clear that it's a bistro so when i walk in i was completely lost when i got servers and everything so but it's super cute um everything went fast the service and everything was super fast um and i spent less than ten dollars between the super duper waffles that you saw and a bottle of water oh my god the waffles were really good i haven't had waffles like that like in forever like they're super like crispy and everything mm -mm -mm. Uh, anyways i can now go home and get shit done so big errands are done now it's time for me to prepare the house prepare my business prepare the house and my suitcase because <laughs> i live in three days so yeah i already have two blog posts scheduled and i have i want to leave two more um because i'm trying to grow my website and increase traffic i'm gonna try to post as many vlogs as i can on the week so i want to post like tasty tuesdays are gonna be for recipes wellness wednesday is gonna be more of a Ooh. wellness um blog and that uh, friday is our fitness friday and then um i want something about health so i'm putting everything about health monday i'm not sure if i do it on thursday but we'll see so i'm gonna be on vacation and my webs all my vlogs are still gonna be loading hello hello it's been a few days since i last grabbed my camera but it's been so insane i've been trying to catch up <laughs> what day is today monday i've been trying to catch up because i'm leaving today on vacation with my daughter and i wanted to like leave everything ready when it comes to my work i wanted to schedule some vlogs um um blog posts i want to leave schedule like everything um and also leave the house super duper clean like i want to come from vacations and as soon as i enter my home still feel relaxed from my vacations instead of coming and be like oh you know with the mess and everything so yeah um i'm leaving at 2 p.m to the airport right now it's 8 a.m well it's almost 8 a.m and yeah so yeah it's almost 8 a.m and i am going to do some errands i also need to stop in the bank to deposit some of the money because i don't want to have like all cash with me um i'm also going to the lab and i am going to get my blood out obviously i'm going to a lab <laughs> Uh, so that way uh, we can know the gender of the baby hopefully this time everything is gonna go right because last time i went i could not do it everything went wrong if you watch my last vlog it was one of the things that went wrong was that i couldn't do the lab test so hopefully by the time i come back from my vacations i only had to wait a few days for knowing if it's a her or a him i feel i think it's a her uh, my gut told me it's a her um I might, it might sound crazy but as soon as i thought about a name i was like okay what well, i'm gonna name the baby the first thing that came to me was a girl name so i don't know if that was a sign because as, as it, it, i tried to figure it out boys names and I, it's something like nothing will come out and i'm like maybe this is a sign you know also um but at the same time, I want to get excited because 
the father uh, so far he only has made the boys he has three boys and um, when I was thinking about kids names when it was the boys I really had a hard time figuring out boys names for Chanel it was easy I kind of figured it out fast and I actually had a bunch of names and I didn't even know which one to choose but for boys it was always hard I never had like a plenty options for this one I finally think I have the name if it's a boy it just like it was like a big like moment i don't know how to explain it the way it came to me it was like so like oh wow this is this is me the universe talking to me you know telling me if it's a boy this is the name so i think i figured out the boy's name but um i'm not gonna tell the names until i know for sure which one it is um and what i did make sure is that the names are very spiritual slash holistic because a lot of people confuse spiritual with like religion like my family are go to church or Pentecostals and stuff like that so when I told my mom I wanted spiritual name she kind of thought that I was referring like church or Bible stuff and like that's not my thing I I don't believe in that things anymore so uh, unpopular opinion controversial opinion how is that how is that what, what is it that it's called but that's not what I'm, I'm meaning I want like a holistic meaning so hopefully I'm making sense I'm all about crystals energy love of attraction that's my thing so um, the names I wanted earthy names you know what I mean like either spiritual or earthy and I think both the boy and the girl are very earthy names and they have a meaning of when they will conceive so that's all I can say so anyway So now we have to wait a week, week and a half for the results. So now we can actually finally put a date on the gender reveal. Before we go, I wanted to share with you something that I got. So, as you know, I'm going on vacation in a few minutes, and I this time I went light. I even amazed with myself because I managed to like do two small um, suitcases. It's usually a huge suitcase plus a small one that it's a carry-on. Uh, but again, I wanted to go simple. I wanted to have just a little bit. Not too much shit in me. And yeah, but I had the two suitcases, but I still had to carry um, another one for my laptop because my laptop is big and it doesn't fit in a backpack. But I also just wanted to have something like light. I wanted a backpack that I can like put just a few things, important things, and that's it. Um, so I can also use it not just to be comfortable in the airport, but also like in the parks. So, because my ta my laptop was so big, I had to have the the two carry-ons, the two small ones for me and Chanel. And then I had to have another bag to take with me on the airplane so I can have the laptop. And then I had to put a backpack inside the, the, the carry-on that I had with me because that way I can then leave the tablet, my laptop in the hotel room and then I can have a smaller backpack. But I figured out uh, what I'm going to do is take one of the small carry-ons with me, Chanel's bag, and I put the tablet, the laptop on that one. So I, I'm, I don't want, I'm, 
I, I'm pretty sure everybody will never risk putting their expensive electronics in the in the carry like you know so you always keep it with you so i'm keeping that small carry-on but it's light and it's again a small carry-on and then i went to jc penny because there was a new purse i've been trying to change my style i've been trying to look more um boss elegant fancy if you say um and i saw this bag that it, in my opinion it looks pretty you know elegant um and it was affordable for me so jc penny right now okay this is the thing i've been dreaming about this purse for like three weeks now and when i went there they had it i think it was like a 30 percent off um and i was like oh my god i gotta have to purchase it on a regular price and this is so frustrating i finally went to get the bag and it was on 45 percent off so it was even cheaper so the weight was worth it but as you can see it's a really cute small bag the original price is $60 but again I got it I got it for 45% off and I don't know it's not a super expensive like you know um, designer one but it still looks pretty and it looks better than the one I had like this this is embarrassing but this is this was my freaking purse guys like <laughs> I had another one, but the other one broke, so I had to use this one in the meanwhile, and it was embarrassing. I didn't even want to take this thing with me anymore. So, as you can see, this is way better. Um, but back to the point, I found everything, as I mentioned, almost everything was 45% off. So when I saw this backpack, I was like, <laughs> we had to get it. Because they will, this is going to be perfect, not just for this vacation, but for many other vacations. Like, I still going on another vacation uh next one it's new york so this is perfect for me to like you know put it back here and be with that in the airport or in the parks or whatever like this is perfect guys and so basically i'm gonna have this and the little carry-on which chanel is so excited she's probably gonna have the carry-on the whole time but i'm gonna be freaking out because that's where my laptop is but as you can see it and i love that because it still looks elegant like i love the colors it's a backpack, but it's a beautiful backpack. Um, still looks elegant, and I'm not gonna look like a fucking idiot. You know what I mean? So, anyways, um, I'm about to get out, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave this vlog right here. You guys, I like this is the last part. As you can see, I've been little by little getting my life together. I'm feeling so much better physically, mentally. I'm in a better space now um i finally have things like figured out the schedule and everything but we're not gonna start the schedule until i come back from vacation so can't wait for the future vlogs to come and yeah thank you so much for like for watching this video if you like it please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that way you get notified every time a new vlog comes by and i will see you on the next one bye for now